my dear in Georgetown Grand Cayman. I believe that as a nation, that God has been good to us. He has shown us great favor. He has spared us. 2020 has been a very trying year. Look at the hurricanes that came by. Look at the storms that came by. Not one person lost their lives as a result of it. That's the protection of God. That's the goodness of God. Look at the virus that is plaguing the entire world. But here in the Cayman Islands, we are able to come together and lift our hands in our country and praise the land of the We do thank God for the good leadership that we have had in these islands. But we also have to realize that our God has protected us. Our God has helped us. And so again, we thank you for tuning in to this service. And we are so delighted to have as the main speaker and the presenter, Bishop Julia Fager. She is a native Caymanian, but she is doing a tremendous work with her husband in the country of Jamaica. She's a woman of many parts. She's a woman who seems to be versed in any area that you can think about. But her specialty is declaring the gospel of the Lord Jesus. Let's welcome to your favor again. Glory be to God. 
Jeremiah 32, and I'm just going to be reading about three verses, praise the Lord. Jeremiah 32, praise the Lord. And I'm going to be reading verses 40 to 42. Praise God. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. And God said, I will make a new and everlasting covenant. I will make a new and everlasting covenant with them. That I will not turn away from them to do the good. But I will put my fear in their hearts that they shall not depart from me. Yea, I will rejoice over them to do them good. And I will plant them in this land assured them with my whole heart and with my whole soul. 42 of Jeremiah 33. For thus saith the Lord, like as I have brought all of this great evil upon this people, so will I bring upon them all the good that I have promised them. Someone praise the Lord. Someone praise the Lord. If I would bring a word, praise God, it would be declare the promises of the Lord over your life. Some of you will be start to praise God. The word of the Lord tonight, praise God, the word of the Lord to give an island. It's those of you that are born again. Those of you, praise God, that have been born with the precious blood of Jesus. You need to not be moved by what you see as people are saying. But you need to declare the promises of God over your life. Over your children. Over your finances. Over your health. Over your marriage. Over your ministry. Over your business. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. As a messenger of the covenant, Jesus proclaimed the conditions and the terms of the new covenant he came to establish. He also gave the disciples some promises. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I believe it's time that we start obeying God. Praise the Lord. And trust in God again. There is a song that says trust and obey. There's a lot of people that want to trust but they don't want to obey. Come on somebody. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I believe that God is going to do something in these islands. I believe that God is getting ready to shake these islands. Praise God. Hallelujah. I believe that when the fire of God begins to pour out on these islands, COVID can't stop it. Pandemic can't stop it. Pandemic can't stop it. Pandemic can't stop it. Praise the Lord. I believe that God is going to move again in his churches. I wish that I had somebody. I like that praise on the back. I wish I had somebody to praise the Lord in here. I believe that what God is saying in this hour, praise the Lord, hallelujah, glory be to God, hallelujah, I believe what God is saying in this hour, praise God, we must get back to basics, we must get back to basics, praise God, hallelujah, praise God, that's everyone to come on that side, I believe that we must get back to basics, praise the Lord, we must get back to where we praise the Lord, we must get back to where we want to pray, we must get back to where we want to fast. The days of just being warm in church is over. You better catch the fire. Can you just look behind you and tell somebody, catch the fire? Say it from your leader, say it like your leader. Shout, tell somebody, catch the fire. Come on, my lover. Tell somebody, catch the fire. Oh, how many want to shoot up two of your hands, not one of them? And just say, touch the Lord, touch the Lord. I need a friend. Some, some people just barely touch the Lord. Can somebody shout, touch the Lord. Touch the Lord. Yeah. I want a fresh touch. Yes, I want a fresh touch. I want a Holy Ghost touch. And then somebody beside you, don't want to praise God. Say, get out of my way. you every church that is willing to allow the Holy Ghost to move God is going to pour his spirit show us prophecy 
is about to come to pass. Oh, I see some of you looking at me so religious. Eh? Well, your religion will get burned if you don't know how to praise God. I uh, wish I had some praise of people in here. I wish I had somebody that would stand up on your feet and start praise God. Serpents 
and scorpions. So if the scorpions even come out, you have the power and authority.
arguing religion. Oh, yeah, see what I want. Okay. I've been in Jamaica for 16 years, so let me talk about my talk. Let me talk too much now. You understand me? Listen. Listen. So let me talk proper English. Some of you don't see what's going on. You know something that I want in a suit, man. Let go 
I say you, you know. So when you can't clap. I never say you, but you not clap, I do me a clap. So get your hopes in order. Because you can't go to heaven with all those things. If you hate your brother and your sister, you can't go to heaven. Come on. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Under the old covenant, God gave the Israelites the land of Kenan Bishop. But in the new covenant, He has given the body of Christ. A heavenly city clock over the new Jerusalem. When I talk, we are going to know Latin. There is a city coming down. Not made with human hands. There is no witness. Can you stand on your feet? There is a heavenly city. The new Jerusalem. That is coming down. One of these days, it will be over. One of these days, there'll be no more tears. One of these days, there will be no more sorrows. One of these days, there will be no more pain. One of these days, there will be no more sorrows. One of these days, there will be no more tears. I just want you to hold your neighbor by your hand. Don't worry about nothing, man. Put down your feet and hold up your neighbor's hand. Let your neighbor feel you. Hold up your neighbor hand, no, 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 no. Let your neighbor feel you. I need a shit now, I need a shit. Let your neighbor feel you. Come on, where there is life, there is hope. Make somebody feel you, man. Squeeze your neighbor hand like right that. So that the person can know they're not dead. I'm trying to hold on in here. You're not dead. Where there is life, there is still hope. Can someone praise God? Then talk for you. Then try to mash your up. Then try to tear you down. But squeeze your neighbor hand. And say this still the boat. Then I run away. I am still here. I am still here. I am still here. Hallelujah. We don't want nobody to leave. We don't want nobody to leave. Come, Bishop. Come. Nobody leave and have a seat. Protocol is protocol. I would never close this with where you came on. I do not know the man of God. Come on. Great stuff. We would like to, we would like to take this opportunity not only to thank Bishop for the ministry tonight. But I believe it's going to be very important for us to pray for our government. Pray for those in authority over us.